1987 Toyota pickup, everybody. It's uh, Toy Cars, etc. Subscribe to us on the YouTubes, on the Facebooks, Instagrams, all the socials. All right, so this vehicle was actually a mail-in from Walmart uh, back in 2017. It's a uh, Zamac edition, um, 1987 Toyota pickup. This vehicle was actually, um, came out in the entertainment series uh, for Back to the Future, as this was the vehicle um, that he wanted so bad. It was parked in his driveway. Uh, it was a cool truck back in the day. Still a cool truck. These things go for tons of money in real life. They're in great shape. So this was a Walmart mail-in. How that works is it basically buy 20 Hot Wheels, cut out the UPC codes back well, this one doesn't have it. A normal car would have it. UPC codes. You mail them in to uh, to the address, and poof, they'll mail you back this little guy right here for a fee. I think it was uh, was a twenty four ninety nine, maybe something like that. Is typically what they go for. So that's fairly expensive. Twenty five bucks plus the twenty cars you got to buy and open, and then the postage to mail it in. Well, recently, probably a month ago, December of twenty, maybe maybe January of 20, these little guys were on sale in clearance at walmart.com for $19.99, free shipping. So, uh, of course, I snagged a couple um, because it's a cool truck and it's 20 bucks and I didn't have to pay 45 bucks to get it. So, this one's kind of cockeyed in there, that's okay. So, as you can see, Zamac, right? No paint. It's got clear coat though. Green stripes, black and green stripes, I should say. The hood and the the uh, roof are painted black with the uh, quad, like lime green stripes. It's got the five like KC uh, spotlights up on top. Racing number one. It's got real riders, of course. These are always cool, uh, cool tires. The uh, black the kind of five star, five spoke uh, rims. Well, as always, pretty detailed, painted headlights, side markers, blinkers on the front, tail lights. No license plate on this one, at least that I can see. Nope. And then, of course, a metal base made in the great country that brings us all these toys, Malaysia. It's got the 2011 copyright, right, which is when they first came out with this casting. And then, of course, it tells you you know, some of the details on the back, hotwheelscollectors.com. This wasn't an RLC, this was just Hot Wheels Collectors. Like I said, it was a mail-in to Walmart in 2017. But check out those clearance uh, clearance sites. $19.99, free shipping. Only three years later. Almost four years later. <laughs> anyway, that's all I got for today. Actually, I don't. I have another car. Wait. I'll just bring this one in. This is the 2018 Collector Edition 70 Blazer. Um, let me throw this stuff out of here. Get out of here. All right. I was going to show you guys this one too because it's uh, another uh, Zamac vehicle, another Collector Edition 70 Chevy Blazer, the 50th uh, anniversary of Hot Wheels. So again, 2018. This is just a cool car. It's got racing number one. It's got like almost like Spectra Flame Blue flames and a stripe on the hood. Of course, as always, pretty good in the details. Painted tail lights, painted bumper, front painted headlights, painted grill, painted front bumper. It's got the uh, chrome five spoke wheels with uh, red, red lines around it. Not the same from 1960 though, don't get excited. Sometimes you see that. It's got red lines. Well, yeah, but it was made in 2020. Um, anyway, all metal base, of course, as they do with generally with these cars. So just throw this extra in here, the 70 Chevy Blazer. I actually picked this up from a local collector. Uh, pretty good price. I didn't have one. I thought it was cool, so I picked it up. One of those uh, Facebook Marketplace finds. You just got to stay on there. Stay on there. Let them, let them take all your attention. All right. That's all I got for today. So basically 87 Toyota pickup, 70 Chevy Blazer. And uh, with that, Toy Cars is out. Till next time.